So we're gonna have four sandwiches. I'm never ordering DoorDash from Eastretto ever again. It put me through an emotional roller coaster. Ooh. I was in such a bad mood, but now I get to eat four sandwiches. Try this one, the goat cheese and fig. Their bread is so good. Mm. I love fig jam in general, and goat cheese is one of my favorite cheeses, and prosciutto is one of my favorite meats, so this is perfect. Look at this one. That's pretty good, though. Spicy something. Mm. Oh, this is good. It's really spicy. I like these two sandwiches better than the sandwiches that we got there last time. Sandwiches are so good. They're like one of my favorite meals to eat. My high school made really good sandwiches and I ate like a sandwich or a wrap every day. Their bread was so good. Armando is approaching. Truffle mousse pate. I actually wish they did like open face sandwich because sometimes the bread is too much. But then the fig is on this one, so I can't eat it, like, separately. Mm -hmm. At least it arrived, but I waited, like, two hours for this. These are a lot bigger compared to bread lamb. This is their potato salad, which looks really good. Woo! Smells like chives. Mmm, pretty good. It'll be good with hot sauce. This one's a vegetarian sandwich. Whoa, this is like really big. Interesting. I don't know if how I'm gonna like this. Oh, if you don't like artichoke, you're not gonna like this. This is mozzarella. This is pretty filled with the artichoke. I know you're supposed to eat it like sandwich, but. That's okay. I wouldn't order it again. It's a nice salad. Next, we try this one. The sauce is really good. Their bread is very similar to bread lamb bread, actually. I'm gonna add some trough sauce. Oops. That's good. I actually like bread lamb a lot. I like their their sandwiches a little bit better. So Leon's finally trying the four sandwiches that I had earlier. I'll let him try the my least favorite and I think is going to be his least favorite first, which is the one that looks uneaten, the artichoke. It's not bad. It's just not my favorite. I'm not sure about this. Yeah, I don't know why I got it. Hello. Actually, with the sauce, it's not bad at all. There's not much left of this one, so it must mean it's good. Mmm. This one is good. I really like this one. Right? It's good. <clears throat> the, the sauce is good. Mm. It's also because these two that I got from Bradlam are prosciutto, and we both like prosciutto a lot, right? This is potato salad, so it's healthy for you. It's good, but very carby. I mean, it's potatoes. But... Alright, what's next? This one's good, I think, too. I like this one. <clears throat> what about that other one? I don't know if you like it because it's kind of sweet. It's sweet. Which one's your favorite, Bebe? I think the one I just had. The bread lamb one? Mm -mm. Oh. Salami. Good sandwiches. I have been waiting this whole week for this moment. So this place is called Nothing Butter and it's a Korean owned small business through Instagram. Look at this. Oh, it 
it smells so good. These might be gone before Leon's back to try. Sorry, the background's kind of messy. Oh, so excited. Wow, look at this. Oh no, the fig fell. Why am I ruining this? Whoa, look at the inside of this. Let me get some of this fig on here. Or just take the whole fig. Mmm. Mmm. That's really good. Next, I want to try one of these. This is the lemon Madelines. I remember my mom really liked these, and I used to eat the ones from Starbucks a lot. The cross section. Oh my god, why is my hand like shaking? Mmm. Okay. I like the lemon glaze. It's a tad bit dry, just a little bit. I'm gonna try the regular one, which is the double vanilla. Ooh. Mmm. Mmm. I really like this cookie. And with coffee, it's so good. Like, I love drinking black coffee with my desserts, it just hits differently. <laughs> Leon texted me, he's like, don't tell me how it is until I try. But we have very similar taste palettes and usually we agree on like if, like for example, I'm pretty sure he's gonna say these are a little dry too. This one's the Earl Grey. I wanna get right in the middle. You really taste that milk tea flavor. However, the only thing I don't like about it is in that one bite, I took all of that milk tea flavor, so the rest of it, there's not much left, you know? Because it is a little dry, it needs that moisture. Because without it, it's no longer milk tea. I definitely like these better than these. Original, I believe. These all kind of taste the same. No. Yeah. They're good with coffee, for sure. They're okay. I wouldn't order again. They don't taste like much, so they have a very slight flavor. Like this pistachio one, I didn't think it, it tasted anything like pistachio. The only way I knew it was pistachio was because there's a pistachio in it, and then I remembered I ordered a pistachio. The Earl Grey one, it's great, but they should put the filling inside. And then the lemon one, it just has like that outer coating of lemon. So, so let's try the matcha one. I'm actually not a fan of matcha flavored anything, but it's slightly grown on me. Oh. Mm. I think if you like matcha, you'll like this. But it's my least favorite one so far. I'm gonna try the last one here, which is just Earl Grey. So the first one I had, the fig, I think it's gonna taste similar because fig was also Earl Grey. So it's very moist. It looks moist inside. Mm-hmm. I'm really good. I'm gonna have a bit more of the vanilla one. Look at that. It looks moist because it is. Mm. I feel like this is hard to make. Honestly, I wish I was a great baker because I would love to make my own like sweets. This is the Ted Lasso Biscuits. If you haven't watched that show, you should. Me and Leon thought we would never like that kind of show, but it's actually a very like feel-good show. And these are the famous biscuits. Ooh, I smell buttery. Doing the right thing is never the wrong thing. They look like butter, sugar butter cookies. So in the show, Ted Lasso gives his boss these every day and she becomes obsessed with them. She's wondering where to get them and it actually is that he's making them by hand every day. Can you spoil it oh, is that really like a spoiler alert? Mmm. Mmm. The Lasso biscuit? Very buttery and sugar. Butter sugar dense. I need my coffee. Oh wow, that's good. Holy crap. I can see why she likes it. 
This reminds me of that video. Have you seen it? Where it's like two old people. He's trying to say like buttery, flaky croissant or something like that. Never seen and it. And he can't, or pie crust. And he can't say flaky. Like they do it so many times. And there's like, he just can't say it. It's so funny and cute. Thank you, Jasper. And thank you, Pepe, for bringing them back. Wait, do you want to try them? A small bite. Good morning. Look, we have a special guest today. district and near arts district is this place and so we just decided to order because postmates on his account is doing 50% off so so we got five sausage links <laughs> and then two group fries hi Bo I forgot what sauces we got we got chipotle aioli pesto mayo ranch and I don't know what this is ketchup or something I'm gonna and go in with a fry that's the curry ketchup Curry ketchup. Mmm. Whoa. I love fries. Well, why are there two sausages in one? Here. Here's some for you. Which one did you want to try first? This I is a try snake. snake. Oh, wait, let's try snake. I want to try snake too. So let's just split it in half. Here's a knife. Thank you. And then you can top it off with some. Um, it is very different to eat this at home. Right. Usually it's like. Wrench yeah, that's shit. true. Like they only gave us a little bit. Rattlesnake. Yes. Rattlesnake. Do they usually put sauce on it? I have like all the mustard and stuff. Yeah. I kind of miss that. This is why I have my own mustard. Because I feel like they have all of that like sauce. Right? So it's different. So I'm putting my own Dijon horseradish mustard and this jalapeno pepper sauce. I'm trying it like that. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Can you even tell it's rattlesnake? No. Mm-mm. It just tastes like a good sausage. I would never know. Do you want some? Mm. Oh my god. Which one do you want to try next? You pick. Mmm. The duck. Ta -da! And then more sauerkraut, because that's the way to go. Oh, oh! <gasps> Whoa! Good save. You have an onion on your leg. Oh, it's good. Yeah, it's very different experience doing it yourself. Because when you're there, it's they... usually like drenched with shit. And then you have like a table full of like different mustards. Yeah. To use. Oh, I actually really like that. The duck is really, really good. Mmm! Oh, yeah. It's got a nice flavor to it. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I don't know how to describe it, but there's definitely no duck feeling at all. But like, you can taste that it's not just a regular sausage. There's no gaminess mm -hmm. at all. But neither did the snake have any gaminess. Did you like duck or did you like rattlesnake better? Flavor is good. I think the duck was really good. Let's try rabbit. Yeah, rabbit. Hi, Bo. Most guys that go will get two to three sausages with fries. We've actually been craving this for a week or so. Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When we walked, we saw it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then we the idea formed in our head. Mm -hmm. Let's try this one. This is the sun-dried tomato. It's the biggest sausage. Whoa, this one's juicy. I just saw the juice like. Where's your pepper at? Right here. Ooh. Ooh, this is good. I'm curious if you can taste the cheese. A little bit. Oh, you ate one? Mm hmm. I ate, a, I ate um, the link. You like it? 
That's really good. No, that's like <laughs> really good. Holy shit. Do you taste the cheese? <laughs> the last one, the best. Spicy Dijon. Mmm. What is it? Chicken and apple. Mmm. We got all this 50% off, so it tastes even better. Yep. And these fries are a lot better fresh. If we were to get this again, we would get it at the place. Yeah. Where they can, we have all the sauces. What would you rate this? Mmm. I think like this is like three out of five. Mm. I think if I was there, it'd be like four. 3.5. 3.5. And I'm so stuffed because I just realized how much bread I just ate. The only reason why we did this was because we got 50% off. We thought about sitting at this coffee shop next to this place to order delivery. Because the fifty percent off only valid for deliveries. Yep. The last close up from Go Get Him. <laughs> really good. Oh. So he got four sweets from Fugetsu something, which is the oldest Japanese dessert making place. And I forgot what we got. I know this one's Ichigo Daifuku. I don't know what this is. I want to try this one. Let's try this. Mmm, this one's good. I typically don't like like Japanese mochi type desserts. This one's like some kind of red bean mochi within a wafer. I don't like red bean, which is why I typically don't like these kind of desserts. Oh, yeah, these are messy. She just threw it out. Yeah, this is why I'm not the biggest fan of uh, these kind of desserts because I'm I don't really like red bean. I'll leave the rest to Leon. Aww. Hi, Papa. Hi, Kitty. You're such a cutie, Bobo. Look how cool he brought me from New York. Thank you. I'm excited to eat these. Dude, our. <laughs> Free call it smush. Wait, was it you I was talking to you about laughing cow? Yes. <laughs> well, like I think purpose and fulfillment are like one is a fundamental basis towards the other, right? Like you cannot have one without the other. Okay, well this is going Put the salmon into pieces. Oh my god, I haven't like drank in a really long time. This I is feel just... like I'm drinking every week. Really? Yeah. Like wine or like no actually. like like drinking every week. Well, okay. I'm not supposed to like shake it or anything, right? Uh, no, I don't think so. Okay. Me too. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. I'm actually so stupid. Table. Show must go on. Yes. Let me first and let's try this. Mm hmm. It's very strong. Ooh, what's good? <laughs> I feel like no one ever just leaves cheese like a block of cheese. I needed some chips in my life. Oh. What the? Is Wait. that right? I don't think it's gonna be bitter. Is it plastic? Okay. How is it? It's good. I mean, I love brie. Soft cheeses are my brie favorite. Brie with jam. Yeah. That combo. I, that's why I wanted to find fig jam, but they didn't have fig yeah, jam. Yeah, I didn't see it. How much vodka did you put oh, in this? Oh, one shot. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I, I want to try this one. Oh, that's good. Oh, this is so creamy. This one tastes like cheddar cheese almost. Mm. I really like this one. I'm content. Me too. There's this new cheese bar. I wanted to go today, but they're closed on Sunday. It's in a, LA? In Pasadena. It's a new one it's called like Agnes Cheese. And I just thought of you because I know you love cheese so much. Mm -hmm. I was like, we should go, but it's closed today. I guess like right now in this point of my life, I feel like I'm a big fan of Yayo Kusama. Mm. And I read this You were her for Halloween. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, read, I read her biography and she moved to New York without a job and she literally moved just to paint 
um, and she didn't really know anyone. And she had her opening ceremony gallery with only three pieces. Is that why you want to do your gallery? Yeah. Only three pieces. She also wrote how she was like living off of bread and butter, like she really didn't eat, and she was living in this like shack, right? And every day she would go to the Empire State Building, like every night, and look at the entire city and like dream that she would make it. Really? Yeah. I it was actually did not know that. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like. Where? Sorry, Leon was like, "Where are you guys?" Oh, do you want to try the salmon? The salmon. 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 I don't even know anymore. Internal temperature mm, too high. Mm, that's good. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Look at the size of this thing. Peanut butter one. You remembered I liked cashew milk. You drink it like every day. Yeah, I do. So good. Mm. How is it good? Mm -hmm. Is the inside soft? Mm hmm. Good. So, Chloe, your yes. favorite is the oatmeal one. Yeah, I do like the oatmeal one. And then I also love the walnut. You should watch the morning show. Is it sci-fi? No. I love sci-fi. It's not sci-fi. <laughs> um, Reese Witherspoon? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's like Bradley Jackson. Bradley Jackson. It was like... Crash landing on you. Yes. Something like Very Star. Good. I knew it was something like Star. Something, yeah. We had it here, actually. Very oily. It is. It's like puddles of oil. Yeah, like cups of oil. Mm hmm. Yeah. I still have to watch Squid Games. I still have to watch Shang-Chi. This is so good, Chloe. Thanks. I missed this.